Hey, while you in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like and subscribe. Which are sown on stony ground, but when they have heard the word immediately, receive it with gladness. This sister had understood that she was an Israelite. Her son was teaching her that she was an Israelite. And then here comes this man, I'm going to take the word from her. Just like our enemies, our own people sometimes are our enemies. This is straight madness. Our people don't know who we are. And don't know our whole purpose of, of being on this earth. Heard, 
Satan come immediately. So the sister was over here getting the word of God. Then the truth, the scripture of Christ, thus said the Lord in the Bible. And this brother comes over here and pulls her away. Straight up Satan. That's what Satan do to take the word of God from you. Even our own people are devils out here. Don't want our people to hear the word of God. Read. And take away the word that was sown in their hearts. And these are they likewise which are sown on stony ground. But when they have heard, the word immediately received it with gladness. This sister had understood that she was an Israelite. Her soul was teaching her that she was an Israelite. And then here comes this song. Just like our enemies. Our own people sometimes are our enemies. This is straight madness. Our people don't know who we are and don't know our whole purpose of, of being on this earth. Hey, bro. Well, what, what, what? Hey, bro. Let me help, let me help you understand some facts. What you need uh, answers for? Well, I, was just, I was just showing them who he is and what we're talking about. Isaiah 1 and 3. A lot of the time, we, we've been told to be African American. That was coined by Jesse Jackson uh, back in 1980s. So, so a lot of that we've been taught late in life. All right, read this. Read. I'm gonna show you something real quick, bro. What's your name? Mar Marlon. Check this out, Marlon. The Book of Isaiah, one and three. The ox knows his owner, and the ass his master's crib. But Israel do not know. My people do not consider. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? We're going to read it again and we're going to take it slow. The ox knows his owner. So an ox, that's the animal that we use to pull carts, pull tools, to till ground back in the day. An ox is a stubborn animal. Stubborn animal. Read. And the ass is master's crib. And the ass, that's a jackass. He said, and the ass knows his master's crib. That's another stubborn animal. So the most high God is he simply the similar to a stubborn animal. That's what he said about the so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, that we are stubborn animals. Read. But Israel do not know. But who? But Israel do not know. That's why I asked you, what's your nationality? What is your nationality? What? Let's put it this way. What have you been taught your nationality is? Right, because we, we were brought over from the west coast of Africa, right? Back in 1916, during slavery, or 1619, during slavery, right? So when they brought us over here, did we keep our traditions? This is how they took our traditions away from us. You see this picture right here? You see his back? That's a real live picture. That's somebody's actual back. They did that to us. Give me that Jeremiah 14. They did this here to us, because when they brought us over here, we weren't able to keep our true nationality. That's why they said, okay, we was uh, Negroes, we was uh, um, uh, niggas, we was colored, we was Afro-Americans at one time, and now we African-American or American uh, uh, Africans, or black Africans, black Americans. We got so many different nationalities. But, but hold on, read that part again? No, read that part again. Because we got so many different nationalities and we don't even consider, right? We don't even think about, damn, what's my true, what language did I, did I speak before English? Because you can ask a, a Russian where he come from. You can ask a British person where they come from and they can speak in their own language. A German, they can speak in their own language. Can we speak in our own language? Was that passed down to us? Read that part again. But Israel do not know. My people do not consider. Our people don't consider. Our people don't consider at all. You been drinking the day? Let me ask you that real quick. Now, all, right, all praise. Now, I'm going to show you what happened to us while we don't have our customs, our traditions, because you've got a beard on your face. And that's one of our customs. That's one of our traditions, to keep a beard. But America here tells you what? Be clean shaven, right? They want us to be them. That's why. And we follow a lot of their traditions, don't we? Read. The book of Jeremiah 14 and verse 2. Judith mourning in the gates there of language. They are black unto the ground, and the cry of Jerusalem is gone up. Judith mourning in the gates there of language. So Judah mourning in the gates there, there of language. Our leaders, those are the gates. Those are supposed to be our heads of protection. Our leaders. But they language, man. 
Our leaders are weak. Our leaders, our leaders accept whatever they, whatever our enemies tell them to get a paycheck. To keep us docile. Read. They are black into the ground. So the Jews are black unto the ground. Jew is short for Judah. That's why we're showing you that sign right there. Because you are uh, American black, you'll be from the tribe of Judah. Showing you that the people in this Bible are black. Now go to 17. 17. The book of Jeremiah, 17 and verse 4. And thou, even thyself, shall discontinue you from thine heritage that I have gained thee. And I will cause thee to serve thy enemies in the land which thou knowest not. Alright, I'm gonna read this part for you again. The, like I was showing you these pictures right here. That slave ship right there, all that, all these are documented in the Bible. Did you know that? All of this is documented in the Bible. They didn't teach us, uh, they didn't allow us to keep our customs, our traditions, our language, nothing. Read that, read that again. And thou, even thyself, shall discontinue from thine heritage. So we discontinued from our heritage when we came over here slaves. So now we call ourselves African American. We discontinue. But we come out here to teach our people who they are according to the Bible to bring them back to their heritage. Because God ain't done away with it. It's still there, but we got to come back to his law, statutes, and commandments. What is the nation? Nation is men leading by example. 